Welcome to Cars Plus and the second half of repairing a Westwood Tahoe Vintage Camper. The pictures you're looking at are the camper in its original colors when it was a private hunting lodge. In this video, you'll see it in its new shining glory. The camper came to custom replications and was completed two months later. Click the link above to see part one. I captured as much video as I could because I wasn't available all the time and basically this was a full-time job for David for the, the two month duration. Now there were some rain showers but the purpose of this footage here is to give you an idea of how much sanding and painting went into this and then there were times when I would help with masking and uh, David worked well into the evenings and sometimes just after sunset to complete the project. In a few minutes, you'll see a video log that I sent to Glenn for private viewing. Be sure to stay till the end. I have some fun stills that I took while all of this was in progress. Hey Glenn, it's Trish. I'm going to do a quick walk around on the camper to show you where we are and what we've done. It's raining right now and it's probably going to rain through Thursday morning. They are expecting some flash floods in the area, probably the whole state from what I've heard. Okay, so here we go. Okay, the window for the door has been put back on and David did some work on these little light fixtures. He's made some improvements with the wiring and some seals. So we're in good shape there. And as you can see, we need to do the upper yellow color and we need to paint the roof. And David's done some work on the drip rail. He's made some improvements there. So we're a little more watertight than when we started out. And the back of the trailer is looking pretty good as you can see. Even got that uh, Gunge taken care of quite a while ago. And we have the maroon stripe going all the way around. I don't remember when exactly David finished this, but the last time I took pictures, it wasn't completed. I don't think there's too much more sanding and priming to do. I believe at this point, the windows, the trim around all the windows and the eyebrows is completed. Anyway, the progress is looking pretty good. I just don't think we'll be able to do much over the next couple of days, but believe me, we are doing as much as we can when we can. So there you are, you are up to date. Have a good night.